Hello everyone and welcome back again. In the previous video, we uh, started with the insert tab and we have explained the cover page, how to create the cover page and also how to uh, working with the table, uh, the properties, the setting of the table, almost everything about the table and how to create a table and working with the table. And the table is very important in the world. We're going to continue with the uh, uh, insert tab and also start with the design tab with the general education department we have already explained that in the online meeting for those who attended the online meeting and for translation department we have no problem uh, we already explained that uh, in the classroom now in the insert tab we say to explain the table now we have a picture from here we can insert the picture we have two ways to insert the picture the first way is the this device, which means add the picture from the device. If you already have a picture, you save the picture, you can just add it from device. And we say that before, if you don't have a picture, you can create your own picture. I mean, uh, I'm talking about the exam, for example, here. So we can, for example, here, from here, make a screenshot, just to print screen, to print the screen, or you can just go to the search and try to find the snipping tool and then just not forget that in the snipping tool and then you can take a picture to any any part of the screen uh, for example I need to take this picture so I can select that then just only right click copy and then I can paste control V or you can just uh, add the picture from the internet as well so here from this device or here just from online in the internet so here I can just try to find something like animals for example I just to find just try to search like search engine and you can select any picture and just insert it so here for example I have to select uh, this picture and the picture for tiger for example and then just say insert now you will see the pictures are already inserted in the in the word file like this then the picture you have as we said before in the insert we can insert any object inside the word file so the picture is an object the table is an object and we said before also uh, every object or any object has a specific tools to work with this object so for example if i click on the picture i will find here picture tools and then here picture format so i can working with the picture from here now here the picture you can just resize you can go here or here to resize the picture from here for example I can just resize change the size of the picture same thing with this picture I can just resize change the size I have to delete the text here from here you can just uh, drag the picture in this way and this way for example you can do anything with the pictures here now I can select the picture and then go to the picture format you can find we have many things here but just the important things is here I can change the design of the picture for example I can make this picture like this and I select this picture and then make it for example like this so from here change the design you can change the border of the picture make it another color for example you can add an effect for the picture like shadow here for example if you can see reflection I can add some reflection you can just add some effects to the picture from here uh, I can uh, here for example this picture is not draggable I need to drag this picture by the mouse so I can just right click on the picture and then you can go to the wrap text and you can select anyone from here for example square now I can uh, sorry this picture I can drag this picture same thing with this picture selected right click and then wrap text and tight for example so now we can select this picture now here in those pictures you can see this in the foreground and this one in the background you can change that I want to make this in the foreground so just right click and then here you can go to the send to bug it's already in the bag I need to make it in the front so bring uh, bring to front so I can just select that and say front now it is in the front this is the important thing in the pictures you can just go here picture format and change the format of the picture then we have also another thing is very important is a shapes here so you can add any shape you want everything is exist here so for example I can select this circle and then just throw it here in the screen then go here insert and then go to the 
uh, sun for example and just draw it here as you want I can go to insert again for example and then add uh, like this one and I can just add it in this way you can write anything inside the shape for example here I can say circle <laughs> here here like sun in this way you can also uh, shape is an object so you can just select in the, sh the shape here and then go to the shape format and you can change the format of the shape like a color for example here like a style theme it's already exists or you can just change it any color you want like for example here I can add this color and also here I can add uh, this color for the Sun for example and here I can go and add uh, another color like this color for example so I can change the colors of the shapes here by the way you can add any shape for example I can you can draw like here by the shapes I mean I can create like a home uh, a very simple home by the shape so you can just go to insert and then I can go to here for example I can add this one here like, uh, this shape for example like a door here I can just add it here I can change the color to the black in this way and uh, here I can draw another thing like uh, something like that here again insert another thing like uh, something like that and I can add some like windows here one and then control C control V to copy and just copy it and paste it here then copy and paste again to add it here to add the third one here and then you can select all by just control and select anything you want windows and just change the color this in the shapes uh, we can also we have icons not very important now also important thing is a smart art here in the smart art if you just select smart art we have many things you can just select like here all so you can see all the categories or all, all types of smart art smart art is like a diagram like a built-in diagrams but built-in shapes here you can select if you have a list you can just select here you can find any list circle process and so on so for example I need to select all here and try to find something like for example I can select this one anything and just say ok now here you can click here and you can write anything for example here you can write one and here just click on it and write two for example and here I can just write a three here in the smart art you can just click on the smart art and from here you can see smart art design you can change the design of the smart art I can make it in this way for example you can change the color colors of the smart art as well from here like this color so now we just did a very easy way I just selected and change everything in the smart art also in the insert we have another thing like uh, a smart art we have a chart here so chart is like uh, something connected with the Excel so we have a data source a source of data in the Excel so we will explain that later in the Excel but now also we need to explain that in just a simple way just go to the chart and then you can select a type of the chart you want like we have a line chart pie chart bar chart and so on it depends so for example I need the column chart I need this type here and just say ok so here I will add a simple chart here this is a chart you can see it's already opened the Excel file you can just edit data here for example I can make this 6 and you can see it's changing I can make this 7 for example and you can see it's changing this is the Excel we'll explain that later you can close that from here also we have chart design you can change the change the design of the chart in this way for example you can of course change the size you can do many things anything you want also in the insert you have screenshot so you can just easy way to go to the screenshot you click on it and then screen clipper and you can here add a picture for example I need to add a picture for the taskbar so I can just select that and automatically add the 
task bar here. Now control I to select everything and just backspace to delete everything. You can just control I and backspace to delete everything in the screen. Uh, in the insert also we have uh, many thing, things like link and we'll explain, we explained that already. So I don't need to make a waste of time with this, not very important now. We have header and footer also very important, like header here in the, the page in the in the word is consist of from three parts here. We have the first part is the header. If you just double click at the top, you will find the header. Double click at the but at the middle, you will find the body, and double click at the end of the page, you will find the footer. So we have header, body, and footer. Anything you write it in the header it will repeated in all pages so we can add anything you want like a date some information will be useful for all pages entire document I mean so here for example I can write my name for example here and if I add another page just to add great another page you can just enter keep enter and you can find in all pages we have Osama here we have my name here uh, you can add anything you want uh, from insert here and then header you can find many headers like this one. For example, I click here. Now I add this header here in this insert footer. Also, you can add the footer. Footer just like header, but at the bottom. Sorry, at the bottom of the page. Uh, we have also a page number, so you can add a number to the page at the bottom of the page. For example, at the bottom of the page, so you can add any one of those. So I click here. Now I add the page number, a number of the pages from here you can add a text box here for example you can to write something so you can select anyone you can just add it and write anything you want here another thing here is important maybe is an equation so you can add any type of equation for mathematics I can add this one for example from here you can just make it bigger you can add it from here just insert an equation you can add the symbols from here also or just more symbols you can add any simple you want from here you can just select it and insert now I insert the symbol here I add it here for example and you can of course delete it by just bug space here. now in the design we have also something important like a watermark I can add the watermark here you can just select watermark is like something wrote in the background of the page so for example here this is a watermark I don't know if it is obvious or uh, clear or not or you can just go here to the custom watermark and you can text and you can write anything for example Jihan and you can change the color of the watermark to make it red and say ok now I have this you can write anything on the top of it because it's just in the background this is the watermark a color page you can just change the color of the page like this way for example if you want or you can add a page page border click on the page border here you can select any type of border like this border for example uh, here you can change the color of the border as well like I can make it a green for example and then okay now I add the border for all pages so not forget that anything you want to insert inside the page you have to go to the insert tab and you have cover page, you have blank page, another page, you have table, picture, shapes, here you can just select anyone from here, A smart art also important, we have many smart arts here, uh, we have charts, uh, uh, many things like link, like header, footer, page number, equation, symbol, and in the design, we have only those three, that, those is uh, very important now, watermark, and page color, and also page border, this is in the design tab here so I hope you understand that and we already explained that before in the classroom and in the online meeting but uh, just this video for review hope you understand that and thank you very much